Okay, here are some propositional translations. We'll start with a simple sentence. Dan wears both a mustache and a goatee. So this sentence is a conjunction. It's a conjunction because of the and here. So the first thing to do in translating this sentence is to find the basic or atomic uh, propositions. So one atomic proposition here is the sentence, Dan wears a mustache. And we're going to call that sentence, doesn't matter really what we call it, but I'm just going to call it M to differentiate it from the other sentence that's involved in this complex compound uh, proposition. The other sentence is Dan wears a goatee. And we're going to call that G. So given these two atomic sentences, Dan wears a mustache and Dan wears a goatee, that we're calling M and G respectively, the way we would translate this sentence, Dan wears both a mustache and a goatee, would be like this. M for Dan wears a mustache, and we're going to use the ampersand to represent the conjunction, and then the G, which stands for Dan wears a goatee. So this says, literally, Dan wears a mustache and Dan wears a goatee, which captures our sentence, Dan wears both a mustache and a goatee. It's just a conjunction of these two atomic propositions.